face. Hey guys, it is your boy, Cool Gamer is Cool, back here with another epic video. This time, it's a video essay about the death of split screen gaming. Thank you for watching. For a long time, split screen or local multiplayer has been a staple for most multiplayer video games. But as times change, companies are pressured to earn more money, sell more consoles, and split screen gaming saves money for the consumer, which in the long run takes money away from the maker or the company that makes the console. By not introducing split screen gaming or supporting split screen gaming, companies can make more money off two consoles and two games for both people to play. Split screen was an influential thing for gamers of all times. But now, as it slowly disappears, we have to become mo more antisocial and instead attempt to both find time in your schedules to play with each other instead of coming over to your friend's house randomly and just playing at random, casually. It creates a world that has less playing with people you know in the real world and more playing with random strangers you meet on the internet. It creates more pressure on the consumer to buy this product in order to virtually hang out of, with their friends. You have to ask yourself, is my friendship worth this cost of this video game? And if it is, then chances are most likely you'll have to buy the video game or you'll buy it just because you want to play together with your friend and that game does not support split screen gaming. The window retreat, y'all lit too deep. Play, play, play with the keys, don't play us a week. So inside. The window retreat, y'all lit too deep. Play, play, play with the keys. This shit way too formal, y'all know I don't follow suit 